What's up, YouTube? Man, How the hell are you? It's your he needs some milk! You got the fuck up! These Amazon people have gotten out of control. I mean, these delivery guys just throw your packages wherever, whenever, however. Dang it, man, it hurts. Oh. But what's up, YouTube? How the hell are you? It's your boy, Big TK, and I'm back with another video, and it finally has arrived. It finally has arrived. Now, what I have here is an awesome, remarkable product that I highly endorse. Now, if you have a Nintendo Switch, or you play Nintendo Switch, you know that it's basically a handheld console, a home console. But this right here, man, it just opens it up, just takes it to a whole new level. This right here is the double A, double A, huh? A A A X A Mini Projector. Now, basically, this is only exclusively for the Nintendo Switch. You're not going to be hooking your PlayStation 4 or your Xbox One up to this thing. It literally docks the Nintendo Switch in it. So, it's pretty awesome. It's kind of similar to the Yes Ojo that came out about a year ago. And that one had a bit of mixed reviews. Um, it kind of lends itself to look somewhat like the Nintendo Switch. This one has a different design. I'm going to open it up and show it to you guys later on. But I've had no complaints. I love this thing. And it's about a fraction of the price of the actual Oja. OJ? Oja? Whatever it's called. Uh, this okay, one if you say so. $30 on Amazon, while the Oja, huh? OJ, whatever it's called, was about $430, so, or $340, excuse me. So you actually get it for a cheaper price. I'm going to go ahead and leave the link of the description down below so you guys can check it out. And uh, let's go ahead and unbox this bad boy. Let's see what's in it. All right, y'all, let's go ahead and see what the contents of this box holds. And would you look at that? It's the projector. Now, full disclosure, I already opened it up. I already unboxed it. I just had to do it for the camera. My excitement could not hold me much longer, so I had to unbox it first and check it out. So, this is the actual projector itself. As you can see, it's very sleek and very, like, modern looking. Uh, it's pretty awesome looking, actually. You have a headphone per, uh, jack for it. But let's be honest, I mean... You're not going to probably use a headphone jack. Uh, you have the DC power cord that actually comes with the actual product. This right here is where you will actually dock your Nintendo Switch. Uh, you just dock it in the back like that. And it, it actually has a firm grip. Like, if I go upside down, it's not going to fall out. It has a firm grip. So it docks right there. Um, <clears throat> let me actually mute that a little bit. But yeah, um, like I said, the power button is right here. So if you want to turn it on. This is how you would turn it on. So of course it starts projecting in. Oops, sorry. <clears throat> and you see it projected a little bit. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it, and you can hear the fan. It's a little loud, but for a device like this, I mean, that's kind of to be expected. It has to have that ventilation going so it won't overheat. Also, uh, it runs about three hours off of a charger, the charger that it comes with. So. I mean, that's a more that's more than enough time to get a good Mortal Kombat game going with your friends or maybe a good Smash Brothers, uh, you know, gameplay going on with your friends. So I would recommend it just for like short spouts of playing games. Not You're not going to sit here and play Breath of the Wild on it, you know what I'm saying, on a full charge. So just keep the charger with you at all times. And uh, But yeah, let's go ahead and see what it looks like in the dark outside. I am outside of my local Hobby Lobby. Hopefully I won't get in trouble, but I wanted to showcase the AAXA projector for the Nintendo Switch. As you can see, I got my Nintendo Switch docked in and we got it projecting on the wall of this Hobby Lobby. And as you can say, see, it looks pretty good. Hopefully it's picking up on camera pretty good, but the screen is pretty beautiful. Uh, pretty beautiful. It's big and beautiful. And man, I'm surprised at the quality of this screen. Uh, it is just so nice. So we're gonna get a game going. And hopefully my camera person can get the footage. 
and I just lost. So, uh, yeah, we're going to start this over again. I can't go out like that. Not, why, not on my YouTube channel. I can't go out like that. So we're going to run this thing back. Uh, I apologize for the audio mishap you might hear. Um, I don't have my mic with me. Uh, so, therefore, uh, it probably is not coming in as best as it could. But I just wanted to show you guys how good it looks. I mean, it's beautiful. If you want to go on a camping trip, you want to play with some friends or family members, I mean, I highly recommend this thing. It's pretty awesome. Hope you guys like this review. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment below. It's your boy, Big TK Gaming. I am out.